Patty Ann Brown is standing by in Westbury with more. Patty Ann? Well, Bill Colleen, the fire started at about 8.30 and it spread quickly. By the time fire departments arrived, an abandoned stable was fully engulfed in flames. The fire department's first concern was squatters. As you know, the raceway has been empty now for several years, and there was a fear that some homeless people might have moved into some of the abandoned barns. But we spoke to the chief, and he said there's no indication at this point that there was anyone inside the barn. Um, uh, as for damage, the fire was contained to one specific barn, which they let burn to the ground. Uh, they say that there was not much value to the barn as it had been empty for several years. This is not the first fire that we've had here at Roosevelt Raceway. In fact, there have been several, most of them found to be arson. The chief says that arson is strongly suspected in this fire as well, although they're still developing evidence uh, to that effect. As you know, there's been some controversy surrounding the closing of the raceway here several years ago. Uh, and as I said before, the chief and the arson squad will be investigating this, and we'll let you know as more details unfold. I'm Patty Ann Brown, reporting from Westbury. Now back to the studio. Bill, Colleen. So